So Michigan's played 32 games. That's a long season for everyone, especially the freshmen. I want you to meet one of our first year players who's making the most of it in her first season away from home. Okay, I'm tired. Okay, so what? You have a championship to win. So it really doesn't matter how tired you are at the end of the season. Yes, it is a grind. And yes, the transition from high school to college is really tough. But everyone, everyone's been through it. You know, everyone survived through it. Michael Jordan's been through it. The best players have been through college. You know, it hasn't killed them, so it's not going to kill me. But it's taken some adjustments for the Queens New York native, who is no stranger to long seasons in high school, where she led her team to three state championships. Being positive is, is the biggest thing when it comes to basketball and college and managing your time because if you're not positive, then you're going to get way down on yourself because you have bad days. And that's what I had to realize. Not every day is a good day. You have bad days. And once I realized that, I was able to, you know, come to my senses and be like, all right, listen, crack down, you're fine. You know, it's going to be hard, but you're going to get through this. She was New York's Miss Basketball last season and a parade All-American who's become a past first guard for the Wolverines this year. Boogie's given name is Lauren, but no one calls her that unless her dad is mad at her. When I was younger, my dad used to play with this guy in New York City, in the streets of New York City, um, whose name was El Boogie. His name was Lawrence, but they called him El Boogie, but he was really good, really, really good, had ball handling, everything. But he never went anywhere with it because he was terrible at school, and he just didn't take school seriously. So my, me, being Lauren, my name's Lauren, my dad goes, you know what, I want to call you El Boogie. Your game reminds me of him. I want to say I was in the third grade. Flaherty the other way. Left side for Zosky. Boogie for three. Got it. And I love it. It describes like kind of my game on the court, you know, always boogieing down the court. And it's just, you know, being from New York, everyone has a nickname. So I thought it was pretty cool to have a nickname, and I love that nickname specifically. My parents pretty much did everything for me when I was back home. You know, laundry, cooking, you know, I have to feed myself now to buy my own things. Um, having a roommate is definitely different. Like I said, I'm an only child. I'm used to just having my own space, but you know, it's a, it's a great experience. And, and the lucky part is my roommate is one of my teammates, not someone that I don't know. And just, you know, enjoy being on your own and learning more about yourself.